Bro! That works. That's nice. the mad damage. What is up, everybody? This is Justin Wong, and Capcom Finding Collection Offline was such a banger. We have to try out online. We have to try out this rollback netcode from Capcom, and I'm not gonna lie, it's it's just really good. We go through the games and everything, and we have a special guest, Rufo Monger, is gonna be playing with us. Um, you know, we're gonna just have a little chit chat and everything like that, get to know each other. But make sure you guys show him some love, show him some love in this channel, uh, like, share, subscribe, all his videos and everything. He does an amazing job of FGC content as well as other content. But other than that, if you guys want to see this video like i said like share subscribe turn on the bell's notification and you know let's try out capcom fighting collection online like the worst thing that ever happened to me to be uh as a fighting game player was to become a youtuber <laughs> <laughs> oh okay it, it's good cool. like and i have I'm, i like oh this is old um uh, i like uh what i do and all but like i have less time to play the games i have less time to pr like i got worse i got way worse you like yeah i feel that i feel like i'm very, more more of a casual player now yeah, that's exactly it. Like, I used to uh, hang with, like, all the best NRS people in Canada, right? Yeah. And nowadays, like, <laughs> no. <laughs> yeah, this is, oh, this is kind of playing good. Yeah, it's still right. Oh, this is old Dark Soccer, so Stasquatch should still have... Yeah, there we go. Because he doesn't have this in the uh, visa. Yeah, does he have the down-down move? I think down-down punch? Oh, uh, Rage Cage? No, nope, he doesn't. Oh, I guess this is his first game. Yeah. Because I can't short hop either in this one. Yeah, I think that's from the second one. The second one you get the short hop. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, play the dips. I'm not feeling anything. And like, Vancouver to Ontario is not nothing, right? That's the entirety of West Coast to East Coast in the States, too. So. Yeah, it is. Yoink. Oh. Bruh, how long is that grab? Yoink. <laughs> long enough. I think it's a match grab, if I remember right. Yeah. Yoink. Bro, is he a grappler low key? <laughs> He's a grappler and beast out of this game. I have no idea. <laughs> Bro, do you think so? Like, uh, we have we have a theory that like this game is like a a Capcom test game, where it's like if this game does well, we might get a possible vampire saviors like in the future. Like, I would love it. Like. Like realistically, the reason anyone's gonna buy this, uh, most people are gonna buy this connection is uh, collection rather, yeah. is uh, for Darkstalkers, right? What is up, everybody? I know I'm interrupting your video, but we always gotta give a big shout out to Panda. Panda has been, you know, hooking us up with just content with PFG and everything like that. So I just need you to give them some love. Go to panda.gg slash varsity. This jersey right here, look at this baseball jersey. Look at that. Look at that. Look at the Panda work the best part is they got the number 15 i don't know if they did this on purpose but number 15 is my favorite number actually they got the letterman jackets as well too this is an amazing line and i mean summer's around the corner you're trying to look swag you're trying to look fly you know panda has always got you like i said go to panda.gg slash varsity um it's limited time as always and you already know bro enjoy the rest of the video yeah it, it's because they, they oh you just oh nice that's that's kind of nice that you get to select your character again i like that Let's try more. Yeah, it's kind of it's because like they heavily advertise this as a Dark Stalkers collection compared to yeah. like, everything else. So it's just like, damn, like if this does well, are we gonna get another Dark Stalkers possibly? Be nice. Like I follow the news and the things, right? So yeah. Capcom's next couple years have been leaked out though, and there ain't no Marvel and no Dark Stalkers. Oh, uh, says that. That's sad. Because oh, do yeah. you do you remember that video that they made at uh? Comic Con where they showed like some type of like HD dog stalkers. Oh, Ono's video. Dark yeah, stalkers Ono's video. Head. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, I remember that. Then that was that was like what ten years ago now. I'm saying, where is that? How do I do the old shell move? Uh, oh, there we go. Hurricane kick. Is it hurricane kick? Yeah, uh, I think it's. Is it hurricane kick? Yeah, it is hurricane kick. I was doing half circle because half the shit back in this day was half circles. Yeah, I think that what's crazy about this game is this game has so much uh, different moves. Like, compared to, like, if you played Vampires, like, if you played Vampire Saviors and you go to this game, you're like, bro, the moves don't work the same. They don't. <laughs> like, Sasquatch is the only character I've ever had decent with, and, like, half my stuff is not the same. Oh! Uh-oh. Uh-oh, that's not good. <laughs> I, I, when I was watching Comic Break, all I saw was this character. Oriko? All or Alboth, or yeah, whatever his name is. Whatever. Yeah. Are you on the GP build or the English build? English. No, Japanese. Okay, oh, yeah. because I think it's Rico in the English build. 
Oh, yeah, it is, it is. I remember back, way back in the day, he was actually the first character I played because I had a Merfolk deck in Magic the Gathering. Yeah. And he's like, oh, he's the Merfolk, so. <laughs> actually, if I wanted to play this game seriously, I, w I would play Victor, like, in, in, like, that Vampire Saviors, like, you know, like, Capcom has, like, that 7K tournament that they're doing for Vampire Saviors. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I would want to play this character just because he's, like, yeah, he just looks cool. But the crazy part is, like, the community is so strong in the North America for this game on, on Fightcade. I think it's because the characters, too. Like, you don't find characters like this in any other game. I think the mechanics also is just super crazy um, as well. Like, there's, like, the tech hit push block, which is, like, you have to, like, slide, like, your hands yeah, to hit all the buttons. Oh, okay, so I choose. This is my favorite game in this whole entire collection. Pocket Fighter. Pocket Fighter. Ooh. It's the cutest thing in the world. This is a game I also got very little knowledge of. Like, I mashed with it to capture a video, but that's about yeah. it. Yeah. Well, you, you chose at the uh, you chose right. Zangief is actually top tier in this game. Is he? Yeah. Oh. So it's because he just does massive damage. Um, so if you like did like a grab of me, it would take like a ton of damage. Oh, me? Is that you? Does this connect it from Steve? It's me. It's <laughs> gotta be me. So, yeah. So this game is like you do have like these chain combos, right? And you you transform into this character. So Chun Li turns into a girl and a schoolgirl by depending on the buttons you press for like 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 punch 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 or punch kick kick punch and stuff like that okay yeah you never want to do that you get rid of your gems it's kind of like your burst okay and then the funny part about dan is like he's actually a tr like kind of like a troll character and the way i mean by troll character is like he's actually good in terms of like buttons uh but when he hits you he only gives himself red gems and that's kind of a reference from his puzzle fighter Okay. Because he only gives red gems in Puzzle Fighter, so that's why they do it. So every time you hit me, right, you'll get like different color gems, right? So if you do like punch, punch, kick, kick, for example, like you see right. you get yellow and you get blue and everything like that, and red, you see you got those mixed colors oh, yeah, yeah. to help build your, your specials. But Dan only gets red. That's why like I have like my max. Ah, it's pretty funny actually. Okay. I just noticed it's like telling me my motion for moves. But this is pretty like it's it's not a game that I think you could like take. Like I don't think there's I don't think there's actually a scene for this game actually. Hey, if we go deep enough, you'll find a scene for any game, right? Yeah, like, that's true. I mean, like I'm pretty sure if somebody ran a tournament, they'll enter. But in terms of like oh like what's like top tier and stuff like that, I, I'm not even sure if that's a thing. I got no idea. <laughs> Seems fun though. Like I, I like the idea behind it. Back in the day when you could just make any random fighting game and stick, right? Yeah. Th this is just more of just like if you're a Capcom fanboy, uh, yeah. you'd be like, "Oh, this game is freaking awesome." Bro, you got that World Warrior? Uh -oh, I'm just picking. Bro, he don't even have the sound. <laughs> Capcom was too cheap. <laughs> he don't have. He don't have the. Oh, <laughs> Boxer versus Blank is not a good match. Whatever. It's, it's the funniest thing ever is like these they they never develop any normals for these characters like the boss characters like yeah. literally <laughs> this all this button is low jab this button is low strong this button is low light kick this little button is low medium kick. oh this you're playing is, world warrior rog no this is a champion edition rog oh, okay yeah well this is the first time they you're able to select the boss characters world warriors uh, unless without a hack you can't play those characters. Bro! That works. That's the mad damage. That's the one thing I remember. The cheesy cycle crusher? Jab crusher beats all headbutts. Really? Yes. Here we go. We got that trade, baby. Oh, I guess it doesn't give you the number. Oh, this version of Bison does have a uh, close light kit. They can't no. use the TOD. Yeah, because this is hyper fighting Bison. Yeah. I remember when the HD Remix came out, that was all I would ever do, was just go online and do Bison TOD to people. Oh, you, <laughs> then you should try a Champion Edition Bison. He's the busted one. He's the best Bison in the world. Yeah, I actually don't know what I'm supposed to do with this game, actually. I had no and I just smashed when I played it. That was it. It's like people, like, the way... It's definitely a very, like, like a, a lame game where you just fly around actually like a, like a Gundam. Yeah. See, those endless walls, I played the
Got an endless wall. So. Nah, that game is cheap. That game is broken. <laughs> it's, not <even> a, <laughs> it's not even a real game. Like, it's not like a real Gundam game. It's just like a Street Fighter with crazy combos type of stuff. Yo! Oh, that, okay, that, that's the button. <laughs> that's the button. Ooh. That is light kick. Is this? That's like be, 10 be... the screen. I do like it has like the knock your shit off kind of thing. Like you have to fight for it. Like Sam show. Some I don't know. It's because you get it. You get it back automatically. It seems like like you don't have to like pick it up. It seems like if you like touch it, like you you pick you pick the arm back up or whatever. I'm trying to figure out like what is my move? Like what does this move does? Is this like grab? I try it. Oh okay. Oh okay. It is a works. grab. Like a mash too. I saw a prompt for shake. What? What's this? Oh, the that's your Tatsu. Tatsu with punch, like punch. <laughs> you in the air? Nope. Stalebait. Stalebait. Is that a draw game? Oh, is this a draw game yet? I need. I need to go watch how people play this game on like uh, Fight Key because I know there's people that love playing this game. Yeah, yeah, I like these designs. Like, I like uh, I like robot stuff that's like not too anime, you know? Yeah. Like more Robotech than Gundam, I guess. Yeah, I mean, Capcom did have like that one golden age of like, let me just let's just make random fighting games across the board. Yeah, those days are long gone. Eh? This is the kind of game, man. If I played it, like, if it was available for me to play as a kid, I would probably put so much time in this. <laughs> yeah, for real. Yeah. Oh, because Street Fighter 2 took over the world. Like, that's the biggest thing because that like most of my audience is like so much younger than me, yeah. right? And us, I guess, but it's like, no, man, you don't understand. Before you're born, fighting games <laughs> were the most important fighting, like, video games in the world. That's they true. They were the Fortnite of video games. Well, there you go. That's the gas. Gas is, uh, gas is uh, different motion. Though. Oh, I just walked always across. So this game, yeah, uh, yeah. I was right, surprised. No, I was saying this, I was surprised. This game, like, you know how like you could choose English and Japanese? Yeah. So there, I guess there's two Dark Starkers games that only came out in Japan, and this is one of yeah, them. Yeah, uh, uh, I could be wrong. My understanding of the story is because um, uh, Dark Stalkers takes more memories than the other CPS2 games. Ah, yeah. So those games have different rosters. Like VSAT 2 does not have Sasquatch. Yeah, yeah. It has, uh, I noticed uh, that. Yeah. They just literally couldn't fit all the characters on the board. Well, that's unfortunate. Yeah, I just never seen it. Even like, cause they have a Dog Stalkers like Japan tournament where like everyone like they just run a Dog Stalkers marathon like all the Dog Stalker games, and yeah. they don't advertise like Hunter Two and and Savior Two at all. Look, even like the little black like sil the black like icon like that's nothing there. It just looks so weird. Yeah. Like it's like something's missing there. Hello. Wait. Okay. Wait. Oh, you don't got anything? <laughs> He's just a little hop. I, I, oh, I can still go. do the big hop, but I can't cancel short hop in the jab in this version. Oh. So I don't get the instant overhead. Nerfed. <laughs> Nerfed. No balance changes, too. Dude, I think Dawn, like, if there was a tier list, this guy has to be top tier. My man has a dive kick. You see how good that dive kick is? Man, I, I don't know. Like, I don't know about Donovan because he's not in Vampire Savior, right? Like. Oh! Yeah, that's, that's sick. What's this do? I don't know what this does. Oh, that's your um, yeah, Dark, dark Force vision mode or whatever. Yeah, Dark. Force. I, I just don't know what <laughs> what it does for him. I have no idea. I remember QB lets her have True Flight. Yep, that's the only one I remember because that was the only one worth doing of the characters I'm like. Oh, that's a god normal right there. I literally have no approach. Oh, there you go. Off. You just did it. Oh, timing's definitely different. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Wow, that's so fast. I never knew how fast that was. That's definitely un. Right. That, that, that's not reactable oh, yeah. whatsoever. Is it, that's the game, right? Is he short hop and then go for low or overhead, ah. or then he short hop, short hop again, short hop hit, then command grab. Like he's baby mode top tier. That's why I like him. <laughs> Damn. It. Oh. Whoa. Oh, you Yo. <laughs> what the f is this, bro? That's so cool. My man flying, bro. <laughs> you good over there? <laughs> I'm living, I'm living. I just, I was not expecting this. I was not expecting this. Bro, that sword is cheap right there. He's just chilling. Oh, I, wonder, I wonder, oh, you what? see that? No. <laughs> yeah. Man, there's so much love in these games. Yeah. Like, Wait, is he, is he just gonna sleep the whole time? Oh, okay, there okay. it is. 
No, that's actually that's actually sick. That's why the series like still persists, man. Because like no other game has personality like that, right? Yeah. Like, that probably cost like an extra thousand dollars. They didn't have to spend. That's to true. Animate that kind of thing, you know, like. I'm actually, I'm actually glad. I appreciate uh, you uh, coming on and playing with me. Yeah, I well, appreciate it, man. Nice talking to you. Let me, if you I don't want get to talk you... to too many people, I'm always like <laughs> busy working. In an island of myself, if that makes any sense. No, it makes sense. Um, and if like, you're, I'm yeah. not part of any group, I'm not sponsored. I just, I'm do the you... guy who does my own thing, right? Yeah. And if you ever need like to do something, let me know. I'm always down to, to help out too. Oh, I appreciate it, man. Thank you very much.